Hello guys, here I will show you how to use last man standing competition spreadsheet. When you open the spreadsheet, you will see several worksheets and you have to start for the setup worksheet. Here you have to set the number of teams, the team names, number of player, player name, number of rounds and games, and wildcard conditions. The one, the spreadsheet that I use here is the light version. The light version only can accommodate until 15 players and 20 teams. Uh, here I will use the Liga, Spanish La Liga as a data feed for uh, this prediction game. First, I already, and also if you open a spreadsheet, you will see number 20 and 15 here. Uh, for the team, since I've informed you that I will use the La Liga teams, I will just copy the team here. Okay. I'll just copy the team. Okay, now the 20 team already in place. And about the player, I think I'll just continue this one. Turn to three. It's the simple one. I just drag here. So now fifteen. I will leave the number of round and games as it is. It will calculate basically automatically. But if you want custom rounds and custom game, you just put your number here. And wildcard condition. You can leave it as it is. Basically, this condition, postpone and pass, will allow any player to advance to the next round if this condition is met. For example, if the games or the match is abandoned because of maybe snow or something, you can type postpone in the team matches and then uh, this game will will be skipped and the result will become an advantage for the player. Okay. Now we go to the matches here. It is still blank. You have to fill round team one and team two. I will put a copy of uh, La Liga matches again. Okay, here. Because it's, this is half competition, so I will just copy and until the 19. Back again. Copy here. Pass. Okay. Team 1. Then you have to define round, or if you if you don't put round number here, you won't get uh, the formula won't work. Okay, one, 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 ten. Okay, this just to speed up, I guess. Uh, sorry. Okay, and then copy this. Okay, now teams already there. Round is set up, and this one this is just a checking table. Okay, so if the match is completed, you have you can type uh, select the result here. For example, okay, maybe I'll explain later. Now go to the pick worksheet where a player have to pick the team. For example, here, Rico Madrid, Barcelona, Deportivo. Remember,
remember that each player uh, every player cannot pick the same team uh, in different round okay so it must be unique and you don't also find see if you say for John Doe 2 you pick Barcelona you won't find Barcelona here no Barcelona Okay. Uh, this is a sample, this random sample of player picks. So, and then if you want to have a brief view about how the last man standing race basically, uh, since the result hasn't been, in, hasn't been in, put it in the uh, matches worksheet, so this is the view that you can see in the beginning. The first picks of every, from every player. Now we go to the matches. Uh, I will use the real result from the La Liga competition because already uh, uh, completed two rounds. Round. Okay, this is the result of the first round of La Liga. As you can see, the first round only produced one, two, three, four, five winners. Yeah, so this one is draw. I'm sorry, I also said that. Oh, sorry. The first round only produce one, two, three, four, five, six winners. It means that if player pick team which has draw result, they will be eliminated. Let's see how the last man standing race. Okay, as you can see here, from 15 player, one, two, three, four, five, six. Eliminated in the first round, and, th and then if you want to see a different view of the last man standing race, you can go to the last man standing race number two. Let's see. Okay, now let's go to the uh, result of the second round. Okay, this is the result of the second round here. As you can see, three matches are ended in draw. And let's go to the last man standing race. Okay, there is one player, Chundu 11, eliminated in the second round. Then, as you can see here, okay. so you can continue this until the end of the, the competition, which is around 19. And I think it will be difficult. To guess correctly until round 19. Anyway, the winner is the lone survivor until the competition is finished. I put some notes here. You can do copy and paste in this worksheet because it will break the formula. For example, you want to copy Atletico Madrid and pass it below. You cannot do that or it will break the player's drop down list formula. Just select the team, that's all. In this worksheet, you can do copy and paste function. But remember, you have to use the paste special function like you see in the beginning of this video when I try to copy the data from Spanish La Liga. And remember that you have to put rounds number here or the formula cannot compare the player picks with the result. Okay guys, uh, 
I think that's all. You can download the light version and play around with the spreadsheet. But if you need more players to get involved in this game, or you want to say modify anything in the spreadsheet, you can purchase, purchase the pro version. Okay, guys, that's all. Thank you. Bye bye.